Good evening, myself and Post. It is Thursday, April the 19th of April 2012. Let's see where it is. And today I'm gonna go to school. Then after school's done, I'm gonna get a haircut. Don't get too excited, it's just a thin out because I don't wanna lose this. But after that, I shall come home and I shall do some tests with this. Because the reason why I have to do tests is because afterwards I have a big video shoot and I don't want anything to go wrong. Um, I'm doing a music video for do 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 this band Revelations. I'm doing a video for them um, at this gig thing they're doing at the PCYC tonight. So that should be fun. And I'm also doing an interview for them. I'm getting paid actual money. Okay, back from school. What happened at school? You might ask. Well, two things happened at school. The school hosts really shitty events. When they do host events, they don't really think about every person. Maybe they don't just think... Maybe they think for the majority of the people that go to school, which are dickheads, and perhaps they don't really consider it the intelligent minority that go to that school. Anyway, they had a dance-off. Hooray, a dance-off. Plenty of shuffling and puffling and, you know, jerking and gherkin, whatever the hell they do, but a Skrillex song came on. And it was the only thing that was vaguely moshable. So I was about to head in there, and I was just going to hate mosh like hell. But then they stopped song, so that never happened. The second thing that they did was Chalk Graffiti Day. Yay! Now, two things. If you're in primary school, Chalk Graffiti Day is not the same in <laughs> high school. Because in uh, primary school, there are like flowers and people and families and stuff. In high school, there's swastikas and racial slurs the majority of which were performed by me and my fucked up friends. Anyway, now I'm back home, and I'm gonna set up the camera for the video shoot. Let's test things out. Oh god, I look so hot. Ah, oh, do you love me? Tell me you love me. So there are two things I wanted to test out before trying it in the field, because once I'm out there, then I can't really change anything because I'm kind of stuck. Um, so, first thing is to test out the effectivity of my homemade steady cam. I have tested it out before, but this is the first time I'll actually be using it. I want to see if it's still fine. I'm using two zip ties instead of one. The second one's just to secure it a little bit more. And the second one, the second issue I'm facing is that if I'm using this external mic, the Audio Technica ATR6550, it seems to kind of just have a little buzzing effect in the background, so I want to see if that still happens. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a dolly shot. Um, and then I'm going to see if A, the noise in the background is still occurring, and B, if the shot is smooth. So it's two tests in one, yeah! Do 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 Oops, that shouldn't have happened. <laughs> This is my favorite bag. You can fit so much crap in this bag. In this bag, I have a camera, a microfiber cloth, an ATR6550, a um, base plate, a hot shoe mount, and a laptop. And yep, that's that's a fair bit of stuff if you wanna if you wanna fill a bag full of stuff and this is definitely the bag to put your stuff in. Hey 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 I'm I'm gonna I am i am I'm a bad person. <laughs> So today, for the first time in Toowoomba, we're experiencing an actual good outdoor venue. The, it has movers. I love movers. Yeah, I'll be directing and directing photography for this event. Okay, so now that's all over. It was pretty good, except for the fact that the crowd was really dead. Revelations could have played a much better set than they did. Um, it was still awesome, don't get me wrong, but they definitely could have gone better. But they just don't really have the motivation when the crowd doesn't do anything. So, if you're ever at a local show, make sure you participate, because otherwise 
you will be the, re be the reason why they're not up to their full potential. Anyway, what happened is these guys started dancing crazily. Um, I had the suspicion that they were on some sort of toxic substance, which was later confirmed. So, so what happened is apparently he got drunk. Yeah, okay. I think the cops just said drunk because they don't want to freak anyone out. I believe it was something a lot worse than alcohol. However, um, he eventually passed out, just completely blacked out. And then they kept him under the shade for a while, even though it wasn't sun. I don't know why they put him under there. But they started, um, you know, cooling him off, giving water to him and all that stuff. They helped him as best as they could. And then... As soon as he started to wake up, they picked them up, picked him up to um, bring him to the ambulance, and then he just kind of bolted. He just he didn't give a shit. He just left, ran away. The cops figured that because he was high off his mind, he would fall over just like he did the first time again. And how about that? He did. Not after. I mean, after. By the way, he fly kicked a police car. He just ran at the cop car, went. Whoosh, Boom! And left this massive ass stent in the door. The cops can't open the door anymore. It's the back door. But they still can't open that door. It left the biggest stent. And then, while he was airborne, the fall didn't change at all. Didn't change the angle at all. It's when, and he just went face first on the ground. I shouldn't laugh at that. He's probably really hurt. But now he's in hospital. He's probably going to face some serious charges. Because cause drugs are bad and he's going to do bad things if he does drugs. And la 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 la. Why did I do that last bit? I'm really not sure. I've never seen anyone do that part for myself. But yeah, I got the Revelations music video done, and we also did a bit of an interview. Uh, the interview will be up before the music video, because I'm trying to perfect the music video as much as I can with the footage that I got. So for now, I'll just give you a few awesome shots that I gathered. Enjoy!